If you like ripping the trails as much as we do here at Sporter X, then you probably want to be kitted out in the sickest shades you can possibly find. This is going to be Oakley's Stick Around. Though most of my cycling is spent on a road bike or a gravel bike, I grew up mountain biking, so I know what I'm talking about when I'm talking about Oakley sunglasses for mountain bikes. I've been riding with them since I was like 16. There's a couple things that we need to cover before we get to the actual shades we're going to talk about today, and that's going to be lens coverage, the frame material on these things, the lens color, which is super important, and then of course venting. All these things are going to help you have the best time when you're out riding. They're all super important equally. So let's talk a little bit about that before we get into the frames. First of all, lens coverage. You want a larger lens that's going to give you a lot of protection from the sun. It's not going to prohibit you from seeing if you look laterally or down. You don't want frame getting in the way, so you want a nice big lens like we have here. And then of course the frame material, that's gonna be super important. You want something that's gonna be stand up to the test of you know taking a hit or two. Hopefully you don't go down, but typically on the mountain bike, you take a couple falls here and there. Hopefully none too serious. The next thing we need to get into, lens color, super important. Oakley has a bunch of fantastic lenses. Their prism technology is second to none. They really know how to fine tune a lens for sport. And when it comes to mountain biking, they have their prism trail lens and their prism trail torch lens. These are gonna give you the most contrast when you're riding in variable light conditions, which is super important if you're out on the trails. You have trees, shrubs, all sorts of stuff that's gonna kinda mess with your vision. These lenses help you see everything while you're going through those color changes and those light transitions. So right there, you get an optimal lens for your mountain biking adventures. The last thing I'm gonna to touch on is gonna be venting. All of these frames in front of me have some type of venting or design that's gonna help with airflow getting up underneath the lens and just enough so that they don't fog up when you're riding, which is terrible. If you've spent a lot of time on the bike, you've probably had this happen at some point. Sometimes it's unavoidable, but these frames are all going to help minimize that. And we definitely want that, especially if you're ripping a downhill and then all of a sudden your lenses start fogging up. That's about the worst thing that can happen. So these frames are going to help with that as well on top of the lens tech that you have and the frame material and the coverage. Okay. So all that stuff, super important when you're out on the trails. Oakley really knows how to fine tune these things for your sport. That's why we picked these five frames. Let's get into the actual frames. Okay, so kicking off our list is a brand new Oakley Sutro frame, which is always exciting. This is the Sutro Light Sweep, very similar to the Oakley Sutro Light. In fact, the lenses are actually interchangeable on these two frames. SFW of 136, it's gonna be a men's medium to large, a women's large fit. And this is, like I said, the newest addition to the Sutro family. It's a great looking frame, kind of has an old school lens type, reminds us of the eye shades from back in the 80s that kind of started off the whole Oakley thing. And this frame is just gonna be great for pretty much all sports. But for mountain biking, I threw it in here. We have to have a Sutro. Let's go with the newest one for 2022. The Sutro Light and the original Sutro are also still great choices. But the Sutro Light Sweep has a new kind of flare and flash for out on the trail. If you like something a little bit flashier, this is gonna be your best option. So large shield lens, like I pointed out at the start of the video, it's gonna give you unencumbered vision. That way when you're out on the trails, none of the frame is gonna get in the way. And you're gonna have this great Oakley Sutro Prism lens, giving you vision in all directions that we really like. And nothing that you notice here in terms of venting, but the design of the, the lens itself actually allows for the air to come up underneath. You get unobtainium grip here in the temples as well as in the nose. And these bridges on the Sutros are just so comfortable. They could sit there all day. I really love that. So it's a very comfortable frame as well. It's gonna fit well over your helmet straps is the way you're supposed to wear your frames when you're wearing a helmet. And you should be wearing a helmet, especially out on the mountain bikes. So this is an altogether great frame. It's gonna fit under your helmet. It's gonna be fantastic. This is my first pick on the list. There you go. All right, guys, hey, just take a quick pause. If you're loving this content right now, like and subscribe to our channel. It helps us and it also helps you because you don't have to go looking for our content anymore. We're right in your feet. Okay, moving on to our next frame, which is gonna be the FLAC 2.0 XL. This is a classic Oakley frame. It's one of their best sellers for great reason. It's got all the design perks that you want in a sports frame, especially a mountain bike frame. A little bit smaller than some of the frames on this list, a little bit low, lower profile, which is kind of nice. A ton of grip to keep this thing in place when you're riding. Some here in the nose pads, unobtainium all the way down the temples, which I really love. It stays right in place. I've used this frame personally since I was 16. This is a great pair of sunglasses for sports. Use it for baseball, mountain bike, road bike, just about everything, you name it, I've done it in these frames. So SFW 135, 
It's gonna be a medium fit for men, large for women, highly RXable, which is awesome for all of our RX fans. Obviously, that's kind of our thing here. So if you're looking for a great RX frame, these guys are gonna be excellent. Like I said, these were my first mountain bike shades when I was a kid growing up. They definitely work out on the trails. They come in all the prism lenses that you want, and that includes trail and trail torch, which is awesome. That means you get the best option for out on the trails. And then the frame itself comes in a wide range of colors and just overall excellent frame construction. And once again, in terms of venting, you don't see any little vents in the actual lens or frame itself, but the design of this frame allows for airflow, really keeps your face cool, which is kind of nice. Um, if you've ever been out on a long, hot day, you're riding, uh, you can actually have a lot of heat buildup behind your lenses and that can create fogging. It can also just lead to kind of a miserable day. So wonderful frames, highly recommend these. They're on pretty much all of our lists and that's not because we're just trying to push a frame that sells well, it's a piece that sells well because it works really well. So keep this in mind if you're looking for a highly RXable frame, non RXable frame, you just want something that's rad on the mountain bike, this is a great choice. Okay, moving on to another new Oakley frame. It's the Oakley Plasma, and it's got a cool retro flare. You might notice when you look at this frame that it reminds you of the racing jackets. That's what it reminds us of. It has an SFW of 132. It's gonna make it a medium for the men, a medium to large for the ladies. And I just love this frame. It's kind of a throwback, very cool, unique look to it. Kind of a little bit more aggressive. So if you look for those more laid back frames for when on, out on your mountain bike adventures, this might not be your choice, but it's not so over the top that it can't go out, you know, to the pub or down to the coffee shop after you ride. Unobtainium in the nose pads here also in the temples to keep it right in place. And of course you have Prism Trail Torch as an option in these frames and they're RXable. So kind of all the things you're looking for. In terms of venting, this one is actually gonna be a little bit closer to face and kind of just enclose your eye capsule. Um, it's not gonna get in the way of your helmet, which is really nice. We want that with all these frames. That's an important feature on mountain bike frames for sure. And so because of the design and because it's so close to your face and they kind of designed it with these little touches here. I don't know if you can see it, but these little things, they actually act as vents and that's gonna help with airflow. So uh, this is gonna be a really protective frame. It's gonna protect your eyes. Like I said, right over your cheeks, kind of fits right around your eye socket um, and it's very comfortable. So this is another great choice for on the mountain bike. That's why it's on this list, obviously. But um, if you look for unique, this is probably the option for you. Okay, and now moving into a couple more frames that are gonna be kind of in that laid back vibe. It's become a lot more popular in later days for mountain bikers to choose frames that are a little bit more laid back. They kind of look like a day to day frame, um, definitely helps with the cool vibe out on the trails and off the trails. And that's what we have here with the Portal X. SFW of 136 here, men's medium to large, women's large fit, and it has a bunch of performance perks. That's one of the great things about this frame. It looks pretty casual and laid back, but you have a ton of unobtainium grip here down the temples all the way. And then here again in the nose. So it's gonna stay right in place. That's important. We don't want our sweet frames flying off into the woods or you know off the side of a cliff. I don't know where you ride, but sometimes you're riding on the side of one of those trails that kind of like goes next to a river, there's a little sheer drop. And then all of a sudden, if your frames dropped, they'd be gone forever. Anyway, not gonna happen at these. Very grippy, very comfortable. These are kind of right on my SFW. They're super comfortable for me. Maybe I need a pair. They're gonna fit around your helmet really well. And I just love the design of these. They really just look like a classic frame, kind of remind you some of the other classic Oakleys, um, like the Holbrooks, but just a sporty Holbrook maybe. And just super great construction. You can feel it's very sturdy here. I'm just flexy enough to fit well around your helmet straps, which like I've mentioned, super good. Um, and then a low profile here, it means it's gonna fit under the helmet. These are gonna be an all around great frame for on and off the trail. And I know that a lot of my friends that mountain bike religiously these days, that's one of their top things that they look for in these frames. Again, also are Exible, which is great. And I know Sunglass Rob loves these. And if Sunglass Rob loves them, he's a big mountain biker, obviously knows a thing or two about sunglasses, they're probably a great choice for you too. All right, wrapping up our list is gonna be the Mainlink XL. This is another laid back frame. I figure I'd give everyone a couple laid back frames since that's kind of the vibe these days. This is the Mainlink XL. Comes in a smaller size, which is the standard Mainlink. The SFW for the big one, the XL is gonna be a 142. It's gonna be an XL fit for everyone. The main link standard is gonna be a 132. It's gonna be a medium fit for men, medium to large for women. And I love the design of this, very comfortable frame when you put it on and wear it. Looks great on your face. It's gonna look great when you're mountain biking or not mountain biking. One of the things that I love about it, like the last frame, is that you have a bunch of unobtainium grip here in the temples and then here in the nose again. It's gonna stay right in place. And that's what you want with a performance frame. So looks casual, 
performs way above casual. It's a great mountain bike frame. It's gonna do its job out on the trails. It doesn't sit as close to your face as some of these other frames, so you get some airflow back there to kind of get rid of the fog uh, problem that you might have, even though there's no venting on it itself. So definitely lightweight, flexy here in the temples. It's gonna fit around your helmet straps really well. I've mentioned that on this video a couple times that you want these frames to be able to fit around your helmet straps. I typically look for a frame that's usually a little bit larger than my SFW because of that for my cycling frames. With this, I don't know if that's gonna be a problem just because it's pretty flexy. So you're probably good if, if with your SFW. If you have an SFW of 132, this is gonna work. If you have an SFW of 142 for the XL, which is the one I'm holding, it will work. All right, the last thing I'm gonna mention about this it does come in prescription, fantastic. It doesn't come in prism trail or trail torch, unless of course you're ordering a prescription frame and then you get to put whatever you want in it. So. Last thing to mention there, doesn't mean that you can't have this if you're not a prescription wearer, there are other lens types that work for out on the trail. Just make sure that um, you're not going to something that's gonna be too dark for the contrasting light situation. All right, so that is it. That's all that I have to say about the top five Oakley mountain bike sunglasses of 2022. Hopefully you're in love with one or all of these frames or somewhere in between. You can, you can love three of them. You don't have to be five or one. Anyway, you definitely know all you need to know for your shopping journey. You need the right lenses, you need the right material, and you also definitely need the right looks for your style. That's really important. You want a frame that you're gonna love to put on, whether you're on or off the trail, something that you want to have with you at all times. So. Those are all super important. You know all that now, so we're good here. Just remember when you're shopping that you can call up our opticians to have them help you out as well. And of course, if you needed more peace of mind, we have our See Better Guarantee, which allows you to try these frames out for 45 days. Free shipping, no questions asked. You're probably gonna love them the first time. If you don't, you've got that going for you too. All right, that's it. Oh, by the way, did you know that we have more content and it's right over here? So you can check that out right now. Um, also remember all of our social media links are down below me so you can check those out. You should follow us there. We have other great content. And of course, thank you for watching today and I'll see you out on the trails hopefully. All right, see ya.